We are right now out in the heart of the New Jersey Pine Barrens. Tonight we're running a light trap which attracts insects that are active at night and it allows us to sense what kinds of insects are around and their abundance. We'll put up a white sheet that the light shines on and that allows us to see the insects very clearly as they come in to the light. We started just at dusk, got our lights set up and turned on. It became pretty dark around nine or so, so we've been out for about three hours and we've had quite a variety of insects so far. Hi, I'm John Gelhouse. I'm curator at the Academy of Natural Sciences of Drexel University. I'm also a professor in the Biodiversity, Earth, and Environmental Science Department at Drexel. What we have set up tonight are two different lights, and so both of them attract insects that are night active. We will take some specimens tonight in those groups that we're interested in and that will do research. So we'll use, um, if we're taking something that we want for the collection, we'll use different bottles with a killing agent, oftentimes um, ethyl acetate, and um, take specimens that way. But I will also collect using an aspirator. So how that works is it aspirates a breathing air in, sucks it in here and into, the two, into here which I can then transfer this bottle either into alcohol or dump it into my kill bottle later. But aspirators are really useful. The Academy's insect collection spans almost 200 years of collecting and is particularly rich in species found in the Philadelphia region, including the Pine Barrens. We're adding specimens here to what's already into the Academy's collection but from a different location, a different time, we're able to uh, expand our knowledge of the species that we're studying. So the insects tonight have filled the sheets. There's probably thousands in when we look at all the sheets we've got running here. They range from the minute to the largest insects that are found here. So these are moths that um, will often fly at dusk and visit flowers with long tubes. And oh, we've got a Carolina locust that came in. Another moth I'll point out is this beautiful pink one here, a pink and yellow one called the uh, rosy maple moth. It's definitely a beetle night so far with lots of different groups of beetles. Here we have ground beetles, several types of scarab beetles. Oh, we got one of my crane flies. Oh boy, that's a beauty. The wings are perfect. Oh, how cool. I think this one is myops because the eyes are small. Wow, nice. Oh, Greg, um, the caterpillar hunter, Calisoma. Really? Look at right here. This is a big ground beetle. They're uh, predators. Wow, look at those mandibles. <laughs> yeah, I, I gotta turn it around, so. And these, these guys give off a really raunchy odor as a kind of a defense mechanism. And it really stinks right now where I'm standing. I like how you're criticizing the smell when you study stink bugs. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So this is a fish fly, which is not a fly and not a fish. Or a conehead grasshopper, right? Well, that's really the okay you do. You got bit? You got bit? <laughs> that's, why, that's why I didn't touch it. <laughs> They've got nasty mandibles. Yeah. We're here in third week of July. It's a very hot night but it's a great time to be sampling for insects. Insects like it warm, and so hot nights can bring in lots of night active insects. And you'll want to sample 
your, the insects at a particular site over the growing season because the species will change from month to month. Insect biodiversity makes up the vast majority of animal diversity on the earth, but insects are poorly known. And so it's, it's very important to uh, census insects at sites far away from us, but also those close in, like here in the Pine Barrens. We actually don't know a lot about the insects that occur around us here in the Philadelphia region. So it's important to be out regularly, seeing what insects are active, um, and who knows, we may discover a new species while we're at it. Oh, it's a tree frog. Yeah, frog on the oh yeah, <laughs> wonderful. Yeah, they'll they uh, get attracted to the insect activity. Scoop, scoop down a little bit. A little bit more. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, there he goes. I love it. <laughs> nice, big. <laughs>